Hello and welcome back to another YouTube video, this time dedicated to casual summer outfits. I do think this is a topic that can be quite difficult to dress for. Um, in the winter we have all the options of layering and making our basics kind of a bit more interesting through layering and combining different pieces, whereas when it's warmer, um, we struggle with that a little bit or it's a little bit difficult to add those layers in. Um, to add the interest. So today is all about how to live your everyday life, your casual outfits um, in a chic way that's appropriate for summer. So I'm looking forward to sharing these outfits. I think there are eight of them. So let's get into the video. So outfit number one is this shorts look with a layered shirt over the top. I'm really loving this layered shirt look provides again a bit of interest to your outfit and it's sort of a replacement for a blazer. It's a much lighter version um, that feels very breezy, easy to throw on. It kind of keeps you a bit covered from the sunshine as well, but still very loose um, and just nice to add that extra layering piece. So the outfit here is from Weekday as well as my next two outfits. The beginning of this section is sponsored by Weekday. If you're not familiar with them, they do some really great pieces um, and not only that, but just kind of what I would call great elevated basics. So those pieces that you can go to time and time again that are something with twist or maybe a really good version of that basic um, and they have lots of that that I'm going to be showing you in this video. So take for example these shorts with the little buttons. I just think they're so cute. The ruched waistband. They just feel although they're casual that they've got something a little bit different about them and you could wear it with a blazer in the evening, dress these shorts up with a blaze and red lipstick or do what I'm doing here pop some sandals on you could wear an oversized shirt over the top like this weekday one or and a classic tank top with it so lots of styling options but just by looking for those little details like that waistband with the buttons just kind of gives your pieces a little bit of something extra I do have a discount code for weekday it is Lydia 10 and it will get you 10% off for the next five days only, so uh, make sure you get there quick. So let's get to the next outfit, also from weekday, it's just this head to toe tonal look. I don't even need to tell you <laughs> how much I love an all tonal outfit, it's just so chic, easy to throw on, and especially in kind of beigey or light tones, you'll know I go to this kind of look a lot, but an all beige head to toe outfit just feels instantly a bit more chic than to say a darker outfit would. It elevates it a bit with the lighter shade, but um, these pieces that I'm pairing together here, the trousers and the top, um, are just so easy to wear in themselves. I am obsessed with these Lyocell trousers. They are beautiful and easy to wear because of the fabric. They feel loose and comfortable, which is key in the summer, I think. There's nothing worse than having fabric that's too tight and clinging to you. So nice, loose, easy trousers are a great one to wear, but I just love the style and the fit and the shape of these. Obviously, slouchy trousers are a thing at the minute, but these are also a really wearable version that are classic too. Um, they've just got everything right about them. They're not too long, which is amazing. They fall really nicely on the waist. They're not too low hung or not too high waisted. They're just like the perfect pair of beige trousers. And I feel like I will get so much wear out of these already. And what I've done here to keep it summery, um, I've paired it with this one shoulder top also from weekday. But what I love about this, and I bang on about this all the time, as you will know, is that I always look for in the summer with those basic pieces or simple pieces, I always look for a little bit of a point of interest, like the tie sleeves here and the kind of double strap. Essentially, this is a basic beige top. But with the um, one shoulder, with these details around the shoulder, uh, with the tie, um, it just makes the outfit a lot more interesting. So really look for those small details like the slouchy trousers with the pleats in them, like the tops with the one shoulder and the tie, just those very small details um, in your basics can make a huge difference and transform the entire outfit. I mean, with this, you don't even need a necklace because it speaks for itself. But if you wanted to, I do think um, instead of flat sandals, you could go for a heeled sandal, you could belt this outfit. Um, lots and lots of styling options um, with this just one simple 
simple piece of trousers and a one shoulder top. So my final outfit from weekday, um, this is such a classic outfit. This is such a me outfit as well, but you cannot, 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 cannot go wrong with this combination. It's a white t-shirt and a black pair of trousers. So I say you can't go wrong, but actually I do think if you invest in the wrong type of basic or kind of get the wrong fit or the wrong shape or the wrong style, it does really alter your outfit. So by concentrating on the small details like the cut and fit of these two pieces that I'm showing you in this outfit, I really think it makes the most amazing classic um, capsule wardrobe set and outfit um, or individual pieces. So the first is this relaxed t-shirt and um, because it's more of a relaxed shape, it's so much more chic and effortless than um, if it were really tight and fitted and again, a bit more summer appropriate. It's mostly cotton, but it's got a bit of elastane in it, which gives it that really nice kind of comfort stretch feel. Um, and it's just, it's just beautifully made. It's just like the perfect t-shirt for me. I would much rather go for this relaxed style um, than a um, fitted one. And it's also not too oversized as well, which I all also struggle with sometimes when a top's too oversized because I usually tuck them in. Um, so go true to size in this and the same with all your weekday pieces, um, they fit pretty much true to size. And then these gorgeous trousers, I already know that these will be a staple in my wardrobe, not just for the summer, but for all year round. These are like going to be my new favourite go-to trousers, black trousers, because they're just such, everything about them is so good. The fit, the shape, the length. I know I touched on the length with the other trousers as well, but I'm not particularly short. Um, I'm just over five foot six, five, six and a half. And a lot of trousers come so, so long on me, which is just crazy. So these are just such a beautiful length. They've just got it just right on. Um, they fall kind of just above the floor. They're not too long, but I do think if you are a bit smaller than me, then they still wouldn't trail on the floor, which is great. Um, and I also think they'll work slightly more cropped if you're taller. So they're a real kind of all rounder versatile for a lot of different body shapes and types. And it was everything about these are good. I love that they're slouchy, but they're not too billowy and wide leg. They've just got that like bob on right with the perfect kind of slouch. I think it's really hard to come by actually, the perfect kind of slouch trouser. And this definitely ticks the box. It's not too exaggerated. Um, which makes them so wearable. It's got um, a loops for the belt. So you can put any type of belt with this and it will transform the outfit and that's what makes it so versatile. These pieces are just so easy to combine with lots of different belts, lots of different shoes, accessories, blazer over the top if you wanted, different kinds of bags. And you could really dress this up and down. I mean, I could see this simple classic white t-shirt and trousers with a killer heel, red lips and diamond earrings in the evening. And it's just such a great look. So that is why you should invest in the good basics. Make sure that the right cut, the right shape like these, because they will stand you in good stead forever. Um, and also like for all occasions as well. So these pieces, I think all of the weekday pieces that I've mentioned tick those boxes. So don't forget Lydia 10 um, for the next five days gets you 10% off weekday. So let's get into the next outfit. So this is a look I've been kind of wearing on repeat lately. Striped t-shirt, I actually wore this exact look yesterday but with black shorts um, to go out and about in. But this t-shirt is from Dera Coco Studio and it's just such a lovely fit and shape and I love this contrasting neckline. Again, just talking about looking for those small details, something like a contrasting neckline could be that detail that elevates the piece. So um, that's definitely one to consider but also just with some loose tailored shorts um, it gives it that formal feel. It gives it a little bit of elevation to the more relaxed t-shirt. And then I've gone for my Nina Bing sandals, some chunky sandals. And I always say, if you want to go for a bit more of a trend piece, then do it in your shoes, your accessories, your sunglasses, jewelry, and then keep the rest of your outfit classic. And I love that combination between the classic striped t-shirt, white shorts, and then the chunkier white sandals. So a really easy combination. And then I've just finished it off for a bit of contrast. My Bottega pouch bag, which um, just 
like I say, adds that little bit of contrast in the colour. Next, an all black look talking about tonal dressing, head to toe dressing. It's very slimming and elongating to wear that head to toe one shade. I've gone back to the weekday tank top that I had on in the first outfit and just paired that with this linen wrap skirt. But the beauty of this skirt, it's from Under the Stories by the way, but the beauty of this skirt is that it really can be dressed up and down and a way to dress it down, keep it casual for the summer days, is just by a simple tank top. But I really think you could go for any kind of color tank top with this. A white one would look really nice as well as the black to just keep it nice and tonal. But um, just a simple skirt, but just a simple midi skirt and tank top is a really nice easy one to go for if you're not like a dress person. Add some, you can add some chunky sandals to it like these Gia Bugini ones, um, but it's just a really easy one to throw together and I'm sure you already have a couple of these pieces in your wardrobe already that you can mix and match um, and pair together to make a nice, easy, simple outfit for summer. So next we've got um, these trousers, which I'm just obsessed with. I got them in on net porte in the sale a few weeks ago, but I think they're sold out. But I just love everything about these. They don't have to be this particular pair, but maybe think about how you could combine printed trousers or other striped trousers together. I love that kind of relaxed pajama style look that's going on at the minute. A lot of brands are doing that kind of style and it's just so chic and effortless but the stripe just gives it a bit of something interesting and then I combine that with simple strappy top again just a really easy throw on piece my Nina Bing sandals to kind of add that trend led element in and finish off with my lower bait basket and like the Bottega bag before with the stripe top I think it's really nice to add a bit of tan into your outfit some warmth especially if you've got blues and the stripes I think adding like a warm tone like that in your accessories um, really finishes it off nicely and creates a nice colour contrast. So I'm really leaning towards all white at the minute, an all white look. I've been doing a lot with this kind of outfit but with jeans, white jeans for cooler days. But a white shirt and white shorts are just so effortless, easy. If you do it in denim it feels more relaxed. Um, the oversized shirt, this is the weekday one again, but the oversized shirt um, just gives it that real kind of effortless feel. I know I talk about effortless all the time, but I do think that's kind of a fundamental part of getting dressed. You don't want to look like you've tried too hard. So this definitely ticks that box. If you wanted to make it even more casual, you could do it without a belt. But again, belt options with this are limitless. You could keep going with all different styles of belts and create lots of different looks with this. But I've just gone for this simple black belt with these black sandals, a bit of color balancing going on, balancing out the black belt in the middle with something darker on the bottom just to keep it all very cohesive. And then finally, the outfit that I am wearing now. So I've got my one shoulder top on, from my collection with Pretty Lavish. So this is the black version. But I do think if you've got a top like this, which potentially could be a little bit dressy, it's black, it's one shoulder, you could wear it for evening. If you've got a piece like this and want to kind of get a bit more longevity out of it, more cost per wear, the ultimate way to do that, I think, is by combining it with a relaxed, elasticated, waistband um it just instantly makes the outfit feel a lot more casual a lot more cool um easy and yeah comfortable as well but especially in the linen it's so easy to chuck on a pair of linen pants and it dresses this top right down and then talking about color balancing as well and color sandwiches we've got the dark on top the dark sandals and then the lighter in the middle. And again, it just creates that balance of color on the eye. So just a really easy one to throw together. I think everyone should own a pair of linen pants in their wardrobe this summer. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Let me know your favorite outfits below. I know you always like these casual outfit videos, so I'll keep them coming. Uh, lots more inspo on my Instagram at Lydia Jane Tomlinson. Again, that will be linked below if you don't already follow me on there. Um, but thanks so much for watching. Don't forget your weekday discount code and I'll see you in my next one.